now logarithmic decrement logarithmic mic degree meant this uh, uh, logarithmic decrement this measures the rate at which the amplitude dies away consider in the expression x equals to a into e to the power minus r t and sin omega dx t plus phi if we choose phi equals to zero then we have x equals to phi is equal to zero and uh, and in this case uh, a as a a naught then we have x equals to a naught e to the power minus r t sin omega dx t and uh, so that uh, uh, so that uh, at t equals to zero x equals to a naught now consider consider a1 a2 a3 dash 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 be the amplitude at uh, time t equals to t 2 t 3 t t c where t is the period of oscillation then we can write then we have and uh, a 1 equals to a naught e to the power minus r t a 2 equals to a naught e to the power minus 2 r t R T and A three equals to A naught e to the power minus three R T and so on. So from this we see that uh, from this we see that uh, A naught by A one equals to A one by A two equals to A two by A three equals to dash 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 equals to dash uh, e to the power r t Or consider this e to the power lambda where lambda equals to rt that is lambda equals to rt we say and uh, it is equal to the uh, r is equal to b by 2m so b by 2m into t or bt by 2m now here lambda is called logarithmic decrement lambda is called logarithmic decrement if we take uh, log then we have uh, 
लॉग ए नॉट बाई ए वन इक्वल्स टू लॉग ए वन बाई ए टू इक्वल्स टू लॉग ए टू बाई ए थ्री सॉरी लॉग ए टू बाई ए थ्री इक्वल्स टू डैश 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 इक्वल्स टू लैमडा Thus, uh, we can say that uh, logarithmic decrement is the logarithm of the ratio of two amplitude of oscillation, which are separated by one period. Now, next topic is uh, power dissipation in damped harmonic oscillator. Power DC station in damped harmonic oscillator power dissipation is damped harmonic oscillator so let first see what is this whenever a system is set into oscillation Uh, it is subjected to frictional or damping forces arising from air resistance or from within the system itself these forces oppose the motion of the system and the work done against these forces is dissipated out of the system as a heat therefore the mechanical energy of the system continuously decreases with time and the amplitude of oscillation gradually decays to zero let us obtain an expression for this power dissipation from the oscillator for it consider at any time instant t the displacement of a damped harmonic oscillator is given by x equals to a into e to the power minus rt sin omega dash t plus phi which we have uh, uh, deduced earlier and consider this equation is 1 and we know that here a and phi are arbitrary constant and r is a damping constant r is called damping constant while a and r is arbitrary constant constant also we know that in this uh, formula omega dash uh, represent under root omega square minus r square and is the angular frequency of damped oscillator and it is known as angular frequency of damped oc later so omega dx is the angular frequency of damped oscillator again we know that omega is equal to under root k by m and r is equal to the uh, r is equal to the b by 2m we know from earlier discussion and uh, k is the force constant in this case k is the force constant now the instantaneous velocity of the oscillator is given by uh, instantaneous velocity v is given by uh, dx by dt so differentiating this equation we get uh, a into e to the power minus R T minus R sine omega dx T plus phi F plus omega dx cos omega dx T plus phi. 
सो इन प्रैक्टिस इन प्रैक्टिस द डेम्पिंग इज वेरी स्मॉल सो डैट आर इज वेरी वेरी लेस देन ओमेगा देन द टर्म माइनस आर साइन ओमेगा डैक्स टी प्लस फाइव इन द इक्वेशन इन द इक्वेशन फॉर बी दैट इज इन दिस इक्वेशन कैन बी नेग्लेक्टेड एंड एंड वी कैन राइट भी एज भी इक्वल्स टू ए इंटू ई टू दावर माइनस आर टी ओमेगा डैस कॉस omega dx t plus 5 so this is the equation for velocity when we neglect uh, this term so this is equation 2 now we can calculate the total mechanical energy now the total uh, mechanical energy of oscillator e can be written as e equals to hmm kinetic energy plus potential equals to 1 by 2 mv square plus 1 by 2 kx square and using the value of v and x from previous equation we have e equals to 1 by 2 ma square e to the power minus 2 rt omega dash square cos square omega dx t plus 5 plus 1 by 2 k a square e to the power minus 2 rt sin square omega dx t plus 5 so this is the total energy of a harmonic oscillator damped harmonic oscillator again we here we see that again because uh, uh, r is very very less than omega so we can take omega dx square equals to omega square minus r square equals to omega square equals to kym when this condition is fulfilled so total energy e we have total energy e hai when we apply this condition uh, 1 by 2 ma square e to the power minus rt k by m cos square omega dx t plus 5 Plus one by two k a square e to the power minus two r t e to the power minus two r t into sine square omega dx t plus five. In this uh, equation, we can take. Uh, Common one by two uh, k a square e to the power minus r t. We can take this as a common. So we have one by two k a square. 
and uh, e to the power minus 2 rt we have taken common from this equation and uh, so we are left with cos square um, omega dx t plus phi plus phi plus sine square omega dx t plus phi now this is equal to 1 so finally we have 1 by 2 k square e to the power minus 2 rt this is the total energy with some condition that is r very well less than omega so from this equation we see that uh, the energy of oscillator decreases with time from this uh, it is clear that uh, uh, the energy of oscillator decreases with time now the rate at which the energy is lost is the power dissipation and is given by p equals to minus d by dt where is the total energy total mechanical energy and uh, from differentiating it we get uh, minus 1 by 2 uh, 1 by 4 1 by 2 k a square e to the power minus 2 r t into minus 2 r so we have p equals to uh, p equals to two r into one by two k square e to the power minus two r t which becomes two r into e because we have e one by two k square e to the power minus two r t 